Hey all, it's John Bellamy here and in this video today, I wanted to address the whole topic of LinkedIn articles, previously called Pulse Posts, and how you can go and utilize those articles in order to really drive more engagement with your audience, more engagement with your actual LinkedIn connections there, and ultimately drive conversations uh, within that. We've found it to be quite a valuable marketing piece and marketing exercise in our business. Uh, we're starting to see some great results for our clients as well. Uh, so I wanted to share this article and video with you today. So let's jump on to uh, LinkedIn. This is in the new user interface here on LinkedIn. And, and what I love about this is they've made it a thousand times easier for you to get started and creating an article. You can literally from your home screen just click on the write an article function. Now, what will happen is when this pops up, it's very similar to if you've ever ran a WordPress uh, blog previously, okay? So what you're able to do here is you're able to put a background image, uh, you're then able to scroll down and include a headline, and then start putting in some text, uh, insert some videos, images, landing page pictures, and whatnot. So you can go through there and, and utilize these these um, instances. So what I wanted to do right now is I actually just wanted to go and share with you um, two different articles that we've created um, that have been getting some great traction um, both in conversation generation on the platform, um, specifically inside of the LinkedIn platform, and then a secondary one, uh, which we'll share in a moment, which has been driving more um, engagement through email opt-in. So more of the traditional internet marketing going to, through to a landing page and then um, adding value through follow-up campaigns from there. So this first uh, article, what we've written, what we wrote and spoke about was ultimately about who you want to go and connect and work with. Um, now, what, what's been really good about this, this LinkedIn article is that it's directly speaking to our connections and we're, and we're asking them and we're genuine, genuinely interested um, and sincere when we, when we ask them and go, hey, like, who is it that you actually want to connect and work with? Because we know that this article and the content that's involved here and the conversations that it can generate both on LinkedIn and off LinkedIn are really going to help everybody out. Okay, so there's some great both digital and, uh, and, and more traditional networking opportunities and introductions that can be made. And most importantly, once again, is that it's driving conversation. So I'm just going to take you through um, this article piece by piece. As you can see here, we've, we've picked a, uh, an image um, to, to represent the article here. And we're, in this instance, we've, we've got lots of people walking down the street mixing and mingling, um, you know, which, which directly ties into the article uh, that we're talking about. We've come up with a headline that is a question-based headline, okay? Um, where if we scroll down here, we've actually um, embedded a video. And what we did in this instance here on this article is we used a Facebook Live video, okay? So we started doing a bit of a cross-channel marketing effort here. Now, if you're like most of the people we speak to, not only will you have a LinkedIn presence, but you've probably got a Facebook presence as well. So what you're able to do here is to uh, go and do a Facebook Live or record a video, and uh, the, the URL um, of that video through Facebook or even YouTube or Vimeo, for example, you can go and embed that URL or paste that URL in here just like we've done there. Um, Scrolling down further, we've now gone into a bit of the content and we've laid it out very uh, using conversational based language. So, um, you know, it's, it's, it's all about driving a conversation and speaking to your target audiences, um, emotions, the problems and challenges that, that they're facing. And, and like always, you absolutely want to go and have a, um, you know, a, and actually you want to create influence and you, the only way that you're going to create influence within that market is to be of genuine, like to have a genuine interest in your connections. Okay, so as we scroll down, you can see we're, we're using bolding text here. We've included that video. We've gone dot points. Um, we've, we've focused in on a couple of key, um, key uh, phrases that we want to draw attention to. Um, and if I scroll right down to the bottom, we've got a clear call to action um, that we want to have happen. Okay, as a result of this. So, um, w like, we actually instruct them. We say, so who do you want to connect and work with? Like, let us know down below. Like, comment below. Um, and then let's connect and, and take it through. And as you'll see, like, we've had um, 10 comments that have come through so far. We've had 20 likes, had a few shares and everything like that. Now, this doesn't include um, the comments that have actually just come back via um, the message response, both on LinkedIn and via email as well, because we're driving multiple different sources of traffic to this as well. And this is one of those timeless articles that we can use for, you know, the next three, six, 12 months 
um, and really start to build upon that. Now, I'm not, I'm not here to show you, like you can see, it's got 20 likes and everything. I'm not here to say this is an article that you're going to go and use to go and get millions of views and be the next big thing online. No, um, this is one of those content pieces which is really looking to drive consistent action within your highly targeted market. Um, if I just scroll down to some of the comments here, so in these comments, you'll notice that there's, there's different connections that are posting up uh, really valuable information about themselves and who they want to connect with. So we've got somebody here who's looking to connect with um, expats, immigrants, um, et cetera. So that's uh, Seema there, you know, and then we can start a conversation. Christine, um, you know, once again, is looking for government opportunities um, and so forth. So there's a lot of different um, valuable insights in towards your customers that we're able to generate from an article like this on LinkedIn. Now, this moves me on to um, the second article that I wanted to share with you right now in this post. Uh, this second article here is, is more of a traditional internet marketing based. It's the how-to headline. It's um, showing people how we're gonna do things in their business and offering that valuable content once again. Uh, so this one was all about um, how to create email opening subject lines. Um, we just picked an image that was just open, um, you know, a nice little neon sign there to try and drive a bit more engagement and traction. Um, what, what's really interesting about this is, you know, once again, we haven't had like a, an abundance of likes or comments or shares um, directly on the LinkedIn platform. But what I can tell you specifically um, is that from the landing page that we have here where people can click um, on there and then they can go and download some information that's actually converting at about 73% right now and um, we've you know we've had quite a number of quality leads coming through there and uh, this is one of the things that I always find intriguing and interesting around content like as much as we want to have you know um, visibility and, and a lot of traction and a lot of eyeballs on our content pieces uh, what's really more important to me and I'm sure it'd be more important to you is is the number of valuable conversations the number of um, valuable database uh, new contacts that you can build in your business so you can start to generate some leads and then therefore conversations and sales. Um, so this article is slightly different. It, it follows a similar layout. Uh, once again, it's utilizing conversational uh, language. We're, we're specifically talking about email subject lines in here. Um, you know, we have a video. Um, once again, this wasn't a, this was just a, uh, uh, a Vimeo video, I believe, that we loaded up for this one, uh, where we pre-recorded it and loaded it up. So this was with one of um, my previous employees that we worked with, um, Heather. And then we actually interviewed and spoke to Heather in this video around um, some of the questions that you would ask in order to elicit and, and to create the subject or the email subject lines in your business. Okay, so once again, we, we went through these five steps that people could go through there. And then my call to, and then we went through a framework, so we've given them value again. And then my call to action down the bottom here, once again, it was, it was a call to action, is, um, you know, on my flight back a few weeks from Melbourne, I, I was, you know, sitting on the plane and instead of watching, um, you know, the entertainment on Virgin, for example, I just started writing some email subject lines that we're going to test, measure and tweak throughout the year. And I just thought, I would share them with you. Um, so the whole objective here was for those people who land on this article that find the content of interesting, they're then able to click the image or the, any of these hyperlinks in there, come to a landing page whereby when they click on the download now button, we're then able to capture their first name, their email address, their telephone number, uh, and then deliver uh, via our email marketing platform, which we use in Fusionsoft, um, the content that they will find of value. So we'll deliver them the 50 email subject lines, etc. cetera, uh, from that aspect. So guys, uh, in this video, really quick in wrapping up here, I just wanted to once again uh, share the importance of utilizing uh, the LinkedIn article platform. And I wanted to just give you some insights into how we're utilizing that right now. It's been 
um, quite effective. It's driven a, quite a number of conversations and, and without question, it's generated at least six figures in business over the last 12 months, uh, just coming directly through um, comments, questions, downloads uh, directly from the LinkedIn article platform. So it's nothing to be sneezed at. And I really just encourage you to um, utilize this or even think about utilizing this in your business. And as always, uh, if you've got any questions, queries, um, you, wanna, you wanna have a chin wag about how you're utilizing LinkedIn and how you can effectively go and uh, generate more connections, more meaningful connections and drive quality conversations utilizing the LinkedIn platform, feel free to reach out. So once again, it's John Bellamy here from Direct Messaging. Uh, post a comment below uh, this video or reach out, connect with me here on LinkedIn. I really look forward to helping you generate more connections, conversations and sales on LinkedIn.